With the holidays just around the corner and prices for just about everything going up this season, drivers are finding a bit of relief when they do go up to fill their gas tanks. Mike Valerio takes a look at the holiday driving forecast and breaks down what you'll have to pay at the pump. The song says there's no place like home for the holidays, but that might not be true for everyone. We are forecasting 113 million people are going to be traveling for this upcoming holiday period. About 101 million will go by car. AAA is forecasting the third busiest year for holiday travel since the agency began tracking in 2000, topped only by 2018 and 2019. But spokesperson Andrew Gross says people are beginning to return to pre-pandemic level travel, which means crowds at the airports and traffic on the roads. Routes in major metro areas are expected to be especially congested both Fridays, leading into the Christmas and New Year's holiday weekends. If you're driving, you have more flexibility because you can decide what time you're going to go. And while soaring inflation means you may be paying more for holiday gifts, drivers are catching a break at the pump. We expect that gasoline prices could be hovering right around the $3 a gallon level, way below even what we saw last year. Gross notes the global price of oil, along with the less expensive winter blend of gas, is behind the steady decline in prices. But to get the most mileage out of that tank of gas and stay safe on the roads, AAA recommends having your vehicle serviced before your trip. <laughs> and plan for anything Mother Nature may have in store. Make sure your fluids are topped, your tires are properly inflated. And also, if there's a big storm coming in and you're driving, you can, you know, choose a different route. In Los Angeles, I'm Mike Valerio reporting.